Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. Today's video is a new series I'm doing. It's called The Games I'm Currently Playing. A lot of people do this type of video and I needed a new type of video to make. So this is a new series hopefully. Episode 1. I'm playing games right now, obviously. I'm actually having a game burnout once again and I don't know, it, it happens quite often to me. Um, but I'm trying to, to progress and get over it, if, you know. But, uh, so I'm not gaming too much lately. It's mainly guitar, you know. I've been making guitar videos. More guitar videos are coming up as well. Um, so yeah. Uh, right now, games I'm playing. Dark Souls 3. Um, didn't get it when it first came out. I didn't have the money. It was at the time, around the time I was saving for PSVR, which I'm now fortunately barely use. Um, I still have to buy more games for it, and then I can use it again. But there's not many games that I'm interested in. Uh, I know that I think Star Star Trek was it uh, got delayed. Um, Cause that was, so you know that sucks. Um, not many other games I'm interested in for VR at the moment. Hopefully we get a new Resident Evil. Because uh, Resident Evil 7, you know, was awesome in VR. A lot of people couldn't hack it. Um, you know, the first experience of the game, they couldn't continue playing the game. Um, which is a shame. I couldn't at first. But, you know, first time, but then I got used to it. But anyway. Um... So I recommend you stick with Resident Evil 7 if you have VR as well. Don't give up on it. You know, you just realise how awesome it is. Because um, a lot of people won't give it the chance. So anyway, back to the video because you know I lost track there. This isn't a video about Resident Evil 7. Maybe I'll make one. Who knows? So anyway, Dark Souls 3. Awesome, awesome game. Like I said, it was about I couldn't get it at the time because I didn't have the money. Um, VR, it was called a VR, but you know, it's it's awesome, you know, it's Dark Souls if you haven't played them, like hard games check them out, because they're you know, they're pretty awesome, but hard I always play as a mage it's just the style of character that I like to play at in these type of games and role playing games and stuff like that mages are just awesome using magic is my thing, using swords and shields isn't, isn't fun for me um Yes, I know a lot of people say, you know, you're not playing the game because, you know, you're not a lawyer or whatever, but, you know, it's my type of character in any genre. If I can be a mage, I'll be a mage, just the way it is for me. Um, but, yeah, uh, enjoying it. I kind of got stuck um, and I can't find any summons. Like, if you don't know Dark Souls, you can summon other players into the gate in your world. I got summoned, because I put my summon sign down, but unfortunately I helped them beat the boss, but it means that I haven't beat the boss still. So I'm trying to find other people to help uh, summon signs and summon other players or NPCs, which I'm still working on finding, doing the quest lines for the NPCs so I can get them to summon them. Um, so I'm kind of stuck on it right now. Um, I, I think my favourite one was Dark Souls 2 because I, I know I just really enjoyed Dark Souls 2 some of the bosses were pretty awesome in that game um, you know the boss is cool in this one as well uh, but I remember Dark Souls 2 had some you know kind of cool awesome hard as hell bosses this one's still hard you know but, and some of the bosses actually seem hard I don't know it's my opinion um, some bosses but you know Really good. It's RPG. You know, you you die. If you die, you lose your souls, and then you go recover your souls um, to get your souls back. And your souls you get from enemies and bosses, and you use that to level up your character, the stats of your character, and buy stuff, items, and weapons and stuff. Um, definitely check these out if you haven't any hard, like hard games. You know, check this one out. Last game I'm playing, not many games lately, um, like I said, 
kind of burn out for as I'm having. Um, State of Decay, actually just beat this the other day. Um, but I'm still kind of playing some of the DLCs of it. Um, it's a really good game if you like The Walking Dead. You've seen The Walking Dead. I mean, it wasn't, right? If you haven't, go watch it. But uh, if you want a Walking Dead video game, this is the one to get ahead. There was a Walking Dead video game, apparently it's terrible. Um, just The Walking Dead game itself. Um, so I never got it. But this game, State of the Cage, pretty much has you. Um, the story's not that great, I never got interested in the story, or the characters, which is a shame, but if you want a game like Walking Dead, like I said, it's this is the game to, to get, because you know, you're know you going around scavenging for supplies, for ammo, for food, and um, medicine, and guns, and, you know, I think I've said guns, uh, ammo, just, you know, fuel, and to fuel your cars, and it's just pretty awesome. Um, in that regard of it being a talking world as well. So you go anywhere you want, go to buildings, scavenge for supplies. The only where you have at this game, like I said, uh, the, the story wasn't great. Um, the final mission, I won't get into it, but it was rather disappointing to me. Um, yeah, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say. I'd say it, it disappointed me. But then the story wasn't really that Black was it was wasn't that great anyway to begin with. It started off alright, but yeah, it lost it lost me. So I wasn't playing for the story. I was playing for you know the surviving the Walking Dead style. You know, you know taking cars. I don't think I've seen a motorbike in this one. Anyway, yeah, it's awesome. You know, it's open world zombies, zombie killing, awesomeness. It's not perfect, it has a lot of glitches. Glitches, I had some characters die over a glitch, um, and that kind of annoyed me. It's cool though, because no matter where you go, there's loads of zombies after you, and um, you know, it, it you can die quite quite easily because yeah, companions are garbage in this game. Like, my companions, like, always die. Uh, I send companions, like other people, to go scavenge your house, they'll end up dead, or they'll come back with the shit supplies, the, the, the garbage supplies, you know, there's guns in there, no, no, but they'll, they'll leave the guns, they won't take the guns, no, they'll, they'll leave the guns for you, they'll leave the best stuff for you to go get yourself, which kind of takes away from the point of the game, which, you know, you're getting them to go scavenge for you, but they don't bring back the bacon, you know, they don't bring back the good stuff, so it kind of, you have to go and go get that yourself, makes no sense to me, um, and also, um, in this game, what's I going to say, what's going to say, oh, um, but it's awesome, you know, it's good, awesome game, you know, don't think I'll play it again, but it was really good, and I definitely recommend it if you like Walking Dead. Zombies. Yeah, definitely check this one out. I was going to say something, but I forgot what I was going to say now. Oh yeah, I wish in the sequel, because obviously it's getting a sequel, a sequel where you can have play with your friends. Um, hopefully you can have a house just with your friends. Uh, a base just with your friends, and not with the NPCs, because you've got a have so much supplies for them as well to use their guns and stuff like that they you, your supplies go for them I'm, maybe I'm greedy I don't know but I'd really like to have my base with just my friends in or my base with just just for me and I keep everything but then obviously it wouldn't be as much fun because you don't have lots of supplies but I'd like to be able to, uh, in this game I'd like to be able to because um, you have like these base houses and uh, I'd like to be able to see that progress. I'd like to see, you know, you be able to actually take part in, like, your gardening and take part in, you know, more of that kind of stuff, surviving and building stuff. But there isn't really that much building in it, obviously. Not much. But, you know, I'd like to be able to take part in some of those things because they pretty much kind of get done themselves. Um, so, yeah, that's the games I'm playing. 
two games right now. Started on a bit of some of the DLC. Um, yeah, not many games I'm playing right now. It's these two, mainly these two. Um, so thanks for watching. If you've got any video suggestions, let me know in the comments below. Like the video if you like the if you liked the video, and um, yeah, subscribe if you're new to the channel and you like my videos. And yeah. I'll see you all later in my next video, which will be a guitar video because I'm doing the Rocksmith 60 Day Challenge, so and other guitar stuff. Um, you can suggest a video if you want to as well. I have some other videos still to make uh, this month. No, thanks for watching. Peace.